I'm gonna need both hands. Happens again, and the boss is coming. So, is there like any type of magical protocol for something like this? I honestly have no clue. This hasn't really happened before. So, why is the town elf still here? I mean, like, I know it's been a couple years since the last incident, but why wouldn't she just leave town after the fluffy paradise fiasco? Honestly, I know as much as the next guy about the town elf. Every city has a town elf, and they do Christmassy things, but what matters is that she has magical abilities and that they were abused by Fedor once before. If, if he has access to her again, terrible things are going to happen. So what's our next move? Captain, I'm sorry. You got Morning! Me. me! I am here looking for the police captain. Oh, she's right here. I found her. What are you doing here, and what's with the spear? I have heard that Fedor has gone missing, and that so has the town elf. And the last time this has happened, I was turned into a bear. And while that was awesome, I just want to be prepared for any situation at all. Whatever. What are you doing here, Mayor and Allie? Shelly, come on. Um, hi, Captain. Sorry for interruption, but... No, 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 no pleasantries. Get right to the point. Come on. Um, so the mayor was wondering, and these were his words exactly, but... When are you gonna catch the bread bandit? Excuse me? Listen, it's been over like a year and you still haven't caught him. Like how hard is it to catch somebody? Well, maybe if you provided us with any usable intel whatsoever, it'd be a lot easier. Listen, that was a very high pressure situation and everyone was shooting at each other and your hothead detective was there and he was shooting at everybody and detective it was- Detective Phipps saved your life and it cost him his. <sighs> Look. Everyone thinks I'm a terrible mayor because there's someone out there killing people and it's hurting my re-election campaign. There are lives on the line and all you're worried about is your stupid election? Okay. And, by the way, you've done nothing but cause trouble for this city since you've been mayor. So, I don't really feel bad for you. Literally name one thing that hasn't been an absolute blessing that I've done. Remember that one time where you shut down that zoo and then you angered that psychotic zookeeper? And then all those people lost their jobs, yes. sent the animals to Canada. I do remember that, yes. Or laying off all the road crew because of your uh, alien awareness uh, program because you thought that potholes were just crop circles. Right, right. Or, even more recently, when you continued on the construction of that ridiculous way station even after the local orchestra became in a gang and started taking innocent lives. Can I con Would you like me to continue? Because I can. Okay. I hear you, and first of all, we still don't have any verifiable proof on how potholes come into existence, so thank you. And second of all, just get the freaking bread bandit! That's all I want! I want you to take responsibility for your actions, and let me do my job. Do my job, take responsibility. Shelly, let's go. Shelly, get the door. Shelly. That, that was... Interesting. So what are you thinking, Captain? I'm gonna go talk to Jessica Rodriguez. You think she's willing to talk? I don't know, but I have to try. I mean, we're still two steps behind these guys, and until we know who's running the show, we're gonna stay that way. Hey, driver. Could you take us by Sonic on the way home? Could really use a cord dog or two. Roger that. Thanks. Hey, Shelly. Yes, Mayor? What do you think? About what? About what the captain said, about how I'm not a good mayor. Well, I think you're always going to have critics. Yeah, but I used to think I was this awesome mayor, like, like the best mayor this side of the Mason-Dixon line, and now I just, I don't know. Can you be real for a second? Like, what do you think? 
Well, I think you have been acting pretty selfishly, and without regards to how your actions could affect the people that you're supposed to be serving. So it is my fault. No, it's not your fault. But I do think you could be partially responsible for some of the things that have transpired. Me too. Have you ever wondered where your taxpayer dollars are going under Mayor Nally's leadership? Pointless construction projects, music videos, personal vacations, yet our city's in shambles. Under my leadership, your dollar is going to work for you. We're going to put that money towards making the city of Bloomington beautiful again. Remember, a vote for Reed is a vote for change. All right, time's up. Out of the car. Get on your knees. All right, hands on your head. Listen, we're done waiting. If you don't comply, we don't need you anymore. Last chance. <laughs> Hands on your head. We're done waiting. If you don't comply, we don't need you anymore. Last chance. Okay. Time's up. Last chance. Okay. Come on. Come on. Okay. Let's see your rage. Yes! Yes! I'm not your prisoner. He's going to kill you unless you kill him. You have to kill me. What? He's close. Okay. Uh, I can feel it. Uh, we're running out of time. No, there's, there's still time. We'll, we'll, there's another way out of this. Is there? Yeah. The, the captain's still looking for us. Uh, they'll, they'll get us out of here. And what then? Then we'll stop Ava. Together.
Cookie's done, boss. Actually, it looks kind of good. Get them to Bane. He's going to take them on a test drive. If they work, get the elf to get started on the next recipe. Yes, ma'am. all that back there. What happened? <laughs> You'll find out soon enough. So why did you break me out? Why now? Look, Plue jumped shit. Ava wanted some more manpower. You should be grateful. Especially after that last time you failed us. Failed? The police ambushed me and killed three of my friends. Friends? Are you going soft? No. No, I, I just haven't had a lot of real food lately, you know, I, and I, I just wasn't exactly expecting you to come break my cell door down tonight. Um, yeah, I'm just not thinking straight. Uh, but could we stop somewhere? I could kill for a burger right now. Yeah, sure. That'll be all. 1164 at the window, please. <sighs> hmm. 
so much better than prison food. Hmm. You're welcome. So, um, can you tell me anything about what's going on? What about, you know, the detectives who arrested me? Are they still a problem? Well, we wanted it to be a surprise, but no. They won't be a problem anymore. I think you'll be pretty happy to see them in their current state. But Mm. your boasting will have to wait. We've got something big coming up. Mm. After that, I'm pretty sure the boss will get you up to speed. Jessica, our time is coming. Soon we will take Bloomington back from the corrupt, the rich, the oppressors of generations who have cut us down with myths of opportunity. Soon, power and authority will be ours and we will take it for ourselves. Our time is coming. Let us prepare. Bane is stronger than ever. Everything we feared is happening. Do you think that there's more people that they've enhanced? My guess would be no. If there was that much power out there, the Bread Bandit wouldn't be able to maintain control. But maybe all he wants is chaos anyways. How are we going to stop him? I don't know yet. But we have to. Every day, the Bread Bandit gets more powerful. And we still have no leads, no evidence. We don't know who he is or what he wants. But we're going to stop him. And Bane. And Fedor. We're going to save the town elf. And we're going to make Joe and Jacob's deaths count for something. Well, let's get to work. What do we know? They got the town elf fast. That means someone's watching us. Or we've got another mole. So we can't really trust anyone. Maybe not even each other. Of course, it's it's a tragic blow for our community. Um, My only comment at this time, I think that we have, unfortunately, a pretty weak display of power in regard to responding to this event. Uh, I think our leadership under Mayor Nally um, is not going to respond very well to this situation according to what we've had experience in the past. Uh, My only other comment, I would encourage our community, uh, I know that there's a lot of fear in regards to some of the criminals that were involved. Uh, I read reports on this Bane character, also I believe Jessica Rodriguez in in regards to this uh, orchestra gang. Uh, I would just encourage everyone, please stay calm, please don't uh, let yourself be afraid. Our active police force is currently looking into the situation. We're doing everything we can. Uh, If you want any more details, though, I would say you need to speak with Mayor Nally. Thank you.